talk to us. It is a wet and rainy and cold day. Um, what you would expect, I guess, in November in Virginia. But yeah, so we're just finishing up the event here at the, the Brevo Eagle Eye Summit. Um, very, very informative today. Got to see some of the future roadmap of some of the really exciting uh, functionality that's gonna be coming down the roadmap. I can't, can't tell you all that stuff just yet, but it's gonna be really, really neat. I got to meet some of the people with the, the Brevo and Eagle Eye organizations that I've only talked to on the phone or uh, exchanged emails with, so that was really exciting. And overall, you know, these types of experiences for me are always impactful because you get one hands-on, face-to-face conversations with the manufacturer to learn more about what what the future is and, and the reason why behind they're doing what, what they're doing. And the second thing is the ability to meet with other people in, in very similar businesses to yourself to share ideas, to, to gain best practices, and to really kind of encourage each other and grow together so those are huge benefits for summits like this on thursday i was able to participate in a panel about how cloud is transforming uh not only our business but our customers and and how we've really utilized the cloud in our business uh, we had an activity where we did a bicycle building event uh, that were the, the bikes were donated to toys for tots they had an amazing uh, dinner last night where they were giving out some awards to some of their their longtime dealers met several other people that are doing things very similar to us uh, but yet had some really good advice about um, about new processes and ways to to, to work on things so uh, man this was a really beneficial event really excited so thank you very much to Brevo and Eagle Eye for allowing me to be a, be a part of this inaugural summit it was very, very exciting, uh, very eye-opening, and look forward to, uh, to, to the future of, uh, of what you guys are about. We're gonna go get loaded on a bus and head back to the airport and then uh, sit in the airport for a couple of hours. So, uh, so long, Salamander Resort. It's been fun. had a conversation with with Lucas a little bit ago and he kind of showed me some of the stuff that we're working on for our website and we just wanted to work on kind of a map of how everything should be laid out I'm not sure if this is actually the way that it should be done or that it will be done uh, but just kind of a little brainstorming on uh, on thinking through that process mm -hmm.